Alright, we're up early in the shed. I'm going to start with this lawnmower, baby. Woo! Haven't used it yet. It's just been sitting here. Alright, about to drop some batteries in. Start this bad boy up. <sighs> Lay it down. Here in front of it, it works better. Clicks in. Okay, got those bad boys in. Alright, I'm in the shed. Let's see how loud this thing is. Hit the start button. Both charge. Let's check it here. Now they're working. Oh, maybe not. Huh, one lights up, but the other doesn't. Let me show y'all. Huh. I don't know. Let's go try it out, though. The height adjustment is at three. I'm going to put it to four.
Apparently the left battery's showing up for some reason. But it seems to be working. Huh. Cut the grass pretty good. The dead grass. But like I said, it's only showing one battery working. So when you first come on, I'll figure that out later. Alright. Alright, we'll figure that out. I'll let y'all know what happens. Maybe we gotta call Greenworks to do some research. Figure it out. But let me get back cutting this grass. <sighs> So obviously this is a little bit of an incline. It's not really steep steep, but it's pretty good. The mower cut a good, pretty good job. Wasn't really hard to handle. I will say, kind of get, get used to the, um, the self-propel. It moves rather quickly, but if you, I think if you're on a flat surface, that self-propel and you want to walk quickly, that's really good. You're gonna get some good exercise there. But it's easy to push. It's not too loud as you guys heard. Uh, it cut the grass pretty good, at least for me. It's, it was really long over here. So as you see, if I miss a spot, it's mainly because of me. But I think it did a good job cutting the grass. I got no complaints. It's kind of thick. It's been weeks. There was already a bunch of dead grass on top because I had to use the weed eater last time. So I think it's good. Alright, let me get back at it. Alright, so I just got done cutting the whole whole yard. Used both batteries. I had about 15,000 square feet. What happens is, when you first put it in, two batteries just show up, but it only uses one. And then when the other one's dead, it kicks over to the next one. It gives you like a boost. So you'd be running real slow, walking slow when you're on the uh, fast speed, thinking, okay, I must be getting tired. It'll do, mm, 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 right fast again, turbo speed. And you walk in so don't be alarmed when you put your battery in it only shows one battery that's how it works so overall real quiet easy to push uh once out of my lawn i got like a, a good hill upgrade back and forth back and forth it was really easy it's just walking so you're not like pushing you know you're just falling behind it letting the self propel go you can turn the blades off and use the self propel when you're just walking around you don't want to cut so overall it's a good one the, again, let me show you. This is the uh, 80 volt, 25 inch Greenworks double blade lawn mower. Got it from the Costco. So, in reality, you could put two in when you start start going. And then when it kicks over, you could stop, put the other one on the charger, cutting, continue to cut, then come back and put the other one back in. Just keep swapping back and forth. Because these things charge pretty quickly with the fast charger. Probably like 30 minutes. So I think it lasts a lot longer than that. But alright man, that's my review. I think I like it. I think next thing I'll probably look at in the future is the uh, the rotting mower. Because man, I'm tired of walking. I'm looking like a bitch right here. Alright, later.